Today in NHL 24, I'm using the brand new Elite's Event Austin Matthews. This card is absolutely sick and I can't wait to try him out. The only problem is, well, I'm gonna be using him at a 50. What? That's right, I have the 50 overall version and we're gonna make him my number one center for a few champs games and see if we can get any points with him. If we win any of these games, we're gonna open up an ultimate pack at the end of the video and we'll get to keep it. If we don't win a single game or if he doesn't get a single goal or if I don't think we deserve it, we'll just discard the pack. This 50 overall, Austin Matthews, is the lowest overall card in Hut history. He has 50 overall stats across the board, and he's going to lead my team to victory, scoring goal after goal after goal, or he's going to be absolutely useless. Let's go ahead and hop into this. If you guys are new, please don't forget to subscribe, leave a like on the video, and let's have some fun with 50 overall Matthews. Now, if you want to try out the 50 overall Matthews for yourself, there's a few ways to get them. First things first, you can trade in four of the Hut Elites collectibles for an Austin Matthews. This can only be completed once. You can trade in 285 Matthews for a 50 overall Matthews. That can also only be completed once. You can trade in eight of the Hut Elites collectibles. You can complete that as many times as you want. You can also get one in the Hut Objectives. And lastly, at the very end of Hut Rush, you can get yourself another one of these 50 overall Matthews cards. Now, in reality, you use the 50 overall Matthews cards to upgrade the 93 to the 94. That's their purpose. But today, he's centering my first line with Nathan McKinnon and Connor McDavid. I have a strong feeling that Matthews is going to be considerably worse than those two cards. Here's a look at the rest of the squad that we'll be using here today. Now, I'm not going to be showing, you know, full games or anything like that. We are showing off this Austin Matthews. He doesn't even have a synergy. A 50 overall Matthews? That must be his playoff card. <laughs> Shut up. All right, here we go. There he is, Austin Matthews on the ice for the first time. And he wins his first face off because he's the best. And he immediately falls over. Now, today is not about winning or losing. It is about seeing what we can do with this brand new Austin Matthews. All right. You already have him at a 90. Ugh. why would you use Austin Matthews at a 90? That's terrible, dude. There he is. Oh my God, <laughs> he's so slow. Holy crap, but he's in. It's like he has full pressure on it all times. That's what it feels like. Score, oh McDavid, no. Matthews doesn't even get a point for that. Oh, I thought, he, I thought they were gonna give it to him. Matthews takes the shot, uh, McDavid deflects it and it finds the back of the net. However, because it went in off of our opponent, Matthews does not get a point. He is the slowest card I've ever used. I have never seen something that slow. It's like me being on the ice, legitimately. All right, Matthews gets absolutely trucked, but he has that puck to McKinnon. He has to puck back, shoots, scores! Austin Matthews, 50 overall, gets the goal. What is happening? Every shot he takes goes into the back of the net somehow. And we're leading two to one. 50 overall Matthews. Why would anyone make the 94 Matthews when you can just use the 50 and score on every shot? And there he is. Austin Matthews up to Connor McDavid. McDavid loses that puck. Man, just couldn't get it done. If it was Austin Matthews, he'd probably have another goal, let's be honest. Nope. Oh, what a great deflection of that pass by Matthews and that puck is going to get out and here he comes up the ice oh what a spin move by Matthews he shoots saved by the goalie the goalie finally makes a save on a Matthews shot how does 50 speed feel terrible it's like he's always under pressure that's not the Matthews I want to see I want to see that Matthews not only did he score a goal but he took a shot that ricocheted into the net earlier as well he has Technically, he should have an assist. He should. They did not give it to him, but regardless, I mean, this is the best card in the game. Matthews wins that draw because he's the greatest. All right, here we go. See if we can get him an assist here with Nathan McKinnon in. He shoots and scores. Austin Matthews gets the assist off the faceoff, and there it is. Second point should be his third point of the game. Oh, Matthews, no! Wide open net, and he hits the side. I guess that's what you get when you have 50 overall accuracy. Damn. After two periods, Austin Matthews is a plus two with two points. Should be three points. 18 minutes of TOA, 
50% shooting percentage, missed that wide open net. We'll say that. 229 puck possession, leading the team. Hasn't thrown a hit. He's taken seven faceoffs. He's won three, 42%, you know? Matthews wins that draw straight back. Matthews shoots and it goes wide. All right, all right. Maybe the experiment's not going to go so great. That was uh, a really good opportunity and he flubbed it. I was going to try and throw a hit with him, but yeah, it's not going to happen. He's so slow. There are no hits being thrown with Matthews. However, that's a nice pass. Oh, McDavid couldn't snipe that. Probably our last chance there to uh, to tie it up. All right, so we're going to lose our first game with 50 overall Matthews, but he had should have had three points. I scored zero goals with the 93. I should have had two goals with the 50. Here's his uh, beautiful snipe. What a shot here by Math. Where is what is the goalie doing? So it hits off of a player, hits off the pad and bounces in and that's an Austin Matthews goal. Matthews! Austin Matthews! He's just so good! 50 overall, Austin Matthews with another goal. His second in as many games and there it is. Austin Matthews gets it. Right place at the right time, I guess, right? Like, holy. There's something satisfying about scoring a goal with a 50 overall Matthews. Just saying, there, there's something great about it. Matthews trailing can't get that one to go, but a good shot. He cannot catch a pass though. Yeah, he has to take a one-timer. Otherwise, that pass is going nowhere. There's the Matthews goal. Hell yeah, man. Little Austin Matthews goal to start out that game. Have him on the ice to start the second as well. But yeah, we are using that 50 overall Matthews and he has been, he's been all right, man. He's been all right. What can I say? He's uh, one for three on the draw. All right, that's not awesome, but you know. Bro, don't take slap shots with Austin Matthews is what I'm learning. Oh my God. Wrist shot? Oh, what a save! Oh, Matthews needed that one, buddy. That's a huge save by Ottinger. And here we go, two on one. Matthews and Morrissey. <laughs> Dude, his shot is so bad. Oh my God. That is what a 50 overall, 50 accurate shot looks like. You ban me in chat? Yep, yeah, if anyone wants to ban him, please get it done. Scores! Connor McDavid! And I believe that's an assist from 50 overall Austin Matthews. There we go. Austin Matthews with another point. He has four points. It should be five points in two games. Wholeheartedly the slowest and sl most sluggish player I've ever used, but he's getting the job done. Matthews! Oh, so close! Oh, man, I would have loved to have gotten a goal there from 50 overall Matthews. Stolar's big flying poke as Matthews still has the GWG right now. We cannot allow a goal. We need that GWG for Matthews. Matthews wins the draw. McKinnon is in on the forehand. Oh, my God, Ottinger, what a save. Otherwise, Matthews has his fifth point in two games. Ah, no! We can't get him the GWG now. Doughty scores. Damn, man. Really wanted Matthews to get that. Oh, that one goes wide. One minute left. He's so, look, so, if you guys haven't seen him yet, when he skates, it's like he's under pressure. Zero energy, and like it doesn't happen anymore now. But if you had zero energy, that's his first penalty. You have zero energy and, he's under, and you're under pressure, that's what he feels like at all times. We get a win with our 50 overall Austin Matthews. Somehow, some way, we won a game. Not only did we win a game, but he had, what, two points in that game too? There he is, he's a plus two, three shots on goal, two points. He had uh, puck possession time of over two minutes. He did take his first penalty. And on the draw, he went 44%. 50 overall Matthews with 50 faceoffs going 44% on the draw. Cannot be upset with that. And he wins the opening faceoff. Because that's what Matthews does. He wins draws and scores goals. And there he, he receives the pass. What a shot, but he can't get it by the goalie. Not sure who is in net, but a good opportunity there. All right, Austin, can you win the draw? Please. 
He does! Two for two on draws thus far for 50 overall Matthews in this game. Matthews! Oh, what a save! Huge opportunity for Matthews, but he gets robbed again. Alright, well, after the first period of this game, it doesn't look like Matthews has done much. Besides win a couple of draws. Yeah, there he is. He's a plus one. He has three shots on goal. And he has the puck for four. He had three shots with 14 seconds puck possession. And for face-offs, he's 66%, so can't complain. But let's see what we can do here in the second with him. I think Matthews got a stick on that. What a great D play. And if he didn't, I'm still giving it to him. That was a good pass, at least. And scores! I think that's an assist! I think that's an assist! Matthews with another point! God! Austin Matthews making plays happen. That was a pretty good pass from him. All the way up the ice, and McKinnon gets the rebound. Another point. I, I'm not joking when I say that he has actually gotten way more points than the 93 did in the two games I used with him. That's scary. A little deke from Matthews? Never mind! <laughs> Do not try to deke with Austin Matthews. Oh my. All right, well, we have a lead after two, and Matthews does have his first point of the game. He has an assist. No shots in that period. But on the face-offs, he is five for six. 83% on the draw. And there we go. We should win this one. Nope, that is the game. Unfortunately, no more points for Matthews in that one, but... I mean, I think it's safe to say this is the best card in the game. I have not seen any card put up this amount of points in three games. Seven for five, so 71%. That's not terrible. All right, so through three games, Austin Matthews had two penalty minutes. He was a plus five, and he had five points. However, he really had six points. We all know this. That first goal should have been an assist. I don't know why it wasn't. It just deflected off a player. But regardless, two points a game for Austin Matthews through three games. Do stats actually matter in this game? I don't think so at this point. Dear God. All right, 100K pack. And ultimate pack. Did we score with Matthews? We scored a bunch with Matthews. So... We, we, get, we deserve this pack, right? We deserve this pack. We deserve to get something big in this pack. Imagine I pulled MSP Matthews in this. Just saying, that would be insane. But we are halfway through, and uh, what are we at? 82 high? 83 high. Cool. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Is it going on YouTube? I, if there's nothing in this pack, I doubt there's any reason for me to put any... What is this ultimate pack? Shake Neighbors, hi. We're at 96. Oh, what is this? An NHL player pack. Ooh. We got that NHL player pack for winning that game. What, 50 overall Matthews? The one I've been playing with all day that you used to upgrade the 93 to a 94. It is an absolutely awful, awful card that puts up two points a game somehow. All right. J all right. That's the second pack in a row where Jake Neighbors was the final card. I, what is happening? Why is that a thing? And we'll do one more ultimate pack before we get out of here. Because why not? 84 high in the last one. There's got to be at least a purple in this one, right? You've got to think. I'm not going to go back-to-back -back ultimates. Ah, we get Philip Zadina, the Red Wings legend. We also get a Stars of the Month McLeod and an 84 tied. They're just giving me 84s. It's going to be 84 high, and I'm going to get like five 84s. Yep, that's what's going to happen. <laughs> EA, come on. That's not funny. They're telling me to use the 84 Matthews. Uh, yeah, there's my fifth 84. There's the fifth 84. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. But at the end of the day, all those 84s mean nothing when you have 50 overall Austin Matthews on your squad, putting up two points a game. What can I say? He's probably the best card I've ever used. So through three games with 50 overall Matthews, we went two and one. He had two goals, three assists, should be four assists. With a 54.16 faceoff percentage, he was a plus five and he took two penalty minutes. Not bad. I appreciate you guys watching. Have a great night, and I'll see y'all tomorrow with another video. Thanks for watching, guys. Stay frosty.